Raya Slate. Yes. Give me a second, y'all. Give me a second. Media Solutions Peace, y'all. Let me, let me, let me, let me put this thing up. The essence. Yes. One second, y'all. We get ready to go on a fantastic journey. Yes, we are. Album review. Yes, we are. Capital to Capital. Thanks for tuning in. Hold up, y'all. Yes, yes. Now you good? I am good. Yes. Yes. Oh, they got my man DJ Arroyo. What's good with you? We get ready to have a good time. Salute, salute, salute. Yes, yes. We get ready to have a good one. Let me just give you, see, for a lot of y'all, see, let me see. A lot of y'all know the sounds. Oh, we got Mac. Oh, we get ready to have a good one. This is where we get ready to go with it. Oh, we get ready to have a good one. Great to see you too, Slade. I see you working. I see you working. Oh, man, how's the sound quality, y'all? Yes, Enzo. Love. Yes. 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 How's the sound quality? Can you hear me good? Can y'all hear me good? I'm, we got my man coming on. Good, good. Yes, yes, we gonna let this. Hey, sir. Garrett, the left hand native, how are you? It's a pleasure. My dude, what's good? What's good with you? How you been? That's all good. Thank y'all, thank y'all. We get ready to have a good time. Sounds good, sounds good. Yes, all right, all right. Yes. Layla Nelson, 93. How y'all doing? I'm going to get all y'all names. When it start popping, I'm going to be like, oh, I'm glad everybody's good. So, yeah, tonight, man, we got, as you see, Granddaddy IU. Listen. Oh, man, here he go. Here he goes. Here he goes. Yes. Yes. Man, in due time, hold up. Oh, man, listen. What up, Peace, beloved. How are you, big bro? Chilling, chilling. What's up? What's good with you? Oh, man, life is up. I woke up this morning. You dig it? Yeah, I could dig it. How that, how that sound quality? Huh? It's, it's you good. Good. You hear me good. Huh? Yeah, crystal clear. Crystal clear. All right, that's what I'm talking about, man. Listen. Yo, are you before we even get into it, man? You know, I've been, you know, been doing these for a little while, man. I've been in Hi Miranda, we've been in the game for a little while doing what I do, man. But it's always honorable, man. Always honorable, man, to to, you know, pay homage to 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 those individuals, man, to those artists, to those legendary rappers that have opened the door up for a slew of individuals. And you know what's so crazy about the IU is that, you know, I've watched your career and you continue to open up doors, man. You dig what I'm saying? Wow. That's what's up. That's what's up. You know what I mean? Um, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm glad you was watching. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, listen. You know, you know this, this business here, man, you know, some, you know, a lot of times we got to stay, on, we gotta stay up on, in tune with all levels of, of, of what music is because it, it, it evolves, you dig? Yeah. But... I will never relinquish ties, right? Never right. relinquish ties with the essence of it. You dig it? The essence, exactly. <laughs> right. Yeah. The <laughs> essence. Yeah. We go. We get. <laughs> we get ready to play a, a word game, man. So you know, you know what's so crazy, man. Um, you know, as I as I shot this out, man, a lot of people was like, "Yo, that's my dude, man." Mm -hmm. A lot of dudes was like, "Yo, that's my bro, right there." You dig what I'm saying? So. You know, even yo, even with doing homework, right? I'm like, damn, how do I select sounds, man? Before we get into it, man. Uh -huh. I, I, you, I, before we get into it, man. When I went on, when I went on, I just checked. I did the homework, right? And I'm saying, it's about like a shit. Sh what's good with you? It's about a you got like about four or five new joints, right? And Raya explained to me exactly what was going on. You did? Yeah, yeah, those were actually not new. 
those is old projects that um, <clears throat> I had a digital distribution deal from back in the days with Orchard, Redline, Orchard, Sony. And um, right today, I don't need that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like anybody, I could put my music on DistroKid, uh, CD Baby, whatever the fuck, by myself. You know what I'm saying? I right. Don't need you know what I'm saying? So I told him to take all that shit down and <clears throat> I just put it back up. You know what I'm saying? So now it's it's looking like it's 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 just coming out, but it's you know what I'm saying that shit been out. That shit been right. out and forever. That shit actually been up on all the um uh, um digital platforms forever. But it's just that right the shit down for a couple of weeks to get my shit right. So now nobody getting no cut, you know what I'm saying? It's just me. <laughs> so Yeah, I knew and for for and and, and, and what we're talking about, y'all, is that you know, today we we hear man based off of uh, his new project, right? Which is called the Essence, right? But he has a few a few new pro he has new projects, right? Well, they not new, they old, but they have been placed up on his all digital out uh, platforms at this current time. But what I wanted you to get out also was the fact that the importance of autonomy. You dig what I'm saying? And yeah. you of all yeah. people, thirty yeah. years in the game. Yeah. The importance of autonomy. Yeah. We are gonna cut him out. We are gonna cut that big mammoth company out cut and get to it. The man, the fuck out. Now, if I could just figure out how to cut this joke kid out, you know what I'm saying? And motherfucking PayPal, because once PayPal, they got this the money from this joke kid and Bandcamp go to PayPal, right? Know? And then take they take a cut. So. I think it ain't no way around that, but you know what I'm saying? Look, well, I'll tell you this. I, I'm going to tell you this. From doing these lives, right, I have been paying attention to all realms of music. And right. some of the artists that 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 have, you know, they have their they, they're following. What they've been doing has been, they've been introducing it. They've been, ha they've been introducing the music on their own, through their own websites, right? Mm -hmm. Until they get a substantial amount of monies, and then they'll, they'll bleed off into all the digital outlets. I've seen some do. I've seen some dudes do it, and make a ton of you know a ton of dollars immediately. You dig what I'm saying? Right. I know Tracy Lee was talking about doing that. Huh? Tracy Lee was talking about doing that. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. But dudes yeah. has been doing it, and then what happens is they'll bleed right off into the digital outlets. They give it about a month or two. They'll mm -hmm. gain that twelve dollars because what it does is what it does is it allows the you it allows you to help you. It gives you a better understanding of where right. The clientele or your fan base is, you dig it? Right, right. And 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 listen, I actually purchased a slew of different albums within the last four months because I wanted to I wanted to get in, involved in and in, in, in what they got going on. Plus, get right. the stories behind a lot of the music and the, and the songs that they've been putting out. You dig? Okay. Right, so, right. I mean, listen, man, we just we it's about it's a, each one teach one. You dig it? That's a fact. You fact. know, so with that being said, man, like my, like I, all the people that's been coming on, man, they tuning in, as you see, they tuning in. Um, I want to take it back, man. I want to take it back, man. So, you know, when you put this, when you put your first album out in 1990. Yeah. Whew. Yeah, I should just turned 30 um, the other day, the 16th, I believe. 30 years ago, that shit dropped. That shit crazy, right? Yo, that shit, this, uh, yo. <laughs> Niggas, god damn. Yo, 30 <laughs> years, y'all. 30 years. Yeah. And let me tell you, can I ask can I ask this IU? You know, because Great. you know, a lot of times <clears throat> people don't understand, man, that as an artist, right? Mm -hmm. Longevity is always key, but right. life happens as well. You dig what I'm saying? Right, right, right. Exactly. Exactly. All type of shit be like your life don't all of a sudden become more fucking uh, peachy king and shit. Like, everything is perfect because you made a record. Nah, right. Types of shit going on. You know what I'm saying? Besides the bullshit that you're going through with the label and, you know, the whole industry bullshit ass shit. You know what I'm saying? Just right. Like, yeah, like. Right, right, right. <laughs> now, can I, before we even get into the album, man, I need to know, man. I need to know. Listen, so remember when that came out, I was, I was in my light teens and shit, right? You know, we ain't gonna throw no ages, right? But I was in right. my teens, right? So, yeah. you know. Huh? We're good still. I'm yeah, yeah, we still good money. We still. Turned 52 in August. Uh, wow. Yeah. 
looking awesome, beloved, and still having fun with it. How about that? That's right. Woo! 52, y'all, and still giving them great music, great sounds. Yeah. Yo, so, Ryan, so with this, right, remember, this is the, remember, y'all, this is the stories behind the song. Mm -hmm. This something new right here, mm -hmm. before we get into it, right, I need to know something new. Where was you at mentally, spiritually, and everything else when you put this song out? Um, actually, if you can remember, yeah, I was just, I was just young. I'm 22 years old. You know what I'm saying? Still on the block. I still, my mind was not on business. You know what I'm saying? I was just right. doing my street shit, and now I'm fucking more bitches than I was fucking. You know what I'm saying? Because I got, you know. I got videos. I got extra paper now. You know how that shit is. I'm like, man, I ain't yeah. fuck, nigga. I'm getting drunk every night, fucking having fun. That's all. The, that's all it was. But but here's the difference. You took on a great persona. Like you know, if you if, if, if we look at your career, we look we we this dude 22 right now. You know we had the canes out on some smooth shit. You just came as like yeah, all right, and then what? You know what I mean? So you yeah. came with the suits, that real mellow shit. And at that time, you knew it wasn't a slew. It wasn't a slew of different rappers out like that. You dig what I'm saying? So, you know, we was looking at like, yo, listen, man, I don't know, man. This motherfucker trying to take Kane style and shit. You know what <laughs> I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Until we heard the music and we was like, yeah, he here to stay. You heard? Mm -hmm. With now, that, with that, uh, huh? That uh, that whole shit with the suit and Kane and all that shit. That shit came from my man, my OG, Easy Rick. God bless the dead. You know what I'm saying? God bless. All the time. Like, if you look on my my actual last project before the essence, it's called P.I.M.P. That's paper is my priority. And I got him on the front cover. My right. Man, Rick. He got the full length mink on, the motherfucking, the mink motherfucking brim. You know what I'm saying? Like, three piece. Nigga, stay sharp. That's all he did. Like, no matter right. what. No matter what we was doing, we at the bar, we fucking um, playing fucking CeeLo on the block. He got a CeeLo, a fucking suit on. Right, and right. Oh, that's just what his thing. So when I when I got my deal and shit, he was like, yo, so what's going to be your image? I'm like, image? What the fuck are you talking about? They got, I'm just going to take some pictures and gonna make the video. <laughs> what I do every day. He's like, nah, you right. nigga, you got to stand out. So he was like, nah, man, you got to put the three piece on and all this, you know what I'm saying? The gangster <laughs> shit. I really hated that shit. You know what I'm saying? I really hated Get the it. fuck out of here. I swear to God. But I saw that niggas was sucking that shit up. You know what I'm saying? So it was what it was. And then when I when we took the pictures for the album cover, I said, damn, yeah, that shit is that shit do look smooth in the motherfucker. <laughs> 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 yeah, right. But every time we had every time we had to do something like a photo shoot or uh, press, whatever the fuck, I had to talk with them fucking suits on and shit. I couldn't wait to get out of them motherfuckers. I put my yo, street gear, you know what I'm saying? Get back yo, to the yo, shit. Hard to tell, though. Hard to, yo, it's so hard to tell, man, because you, you wore it well, and the image was there. Up until this day, you still manage, right? You still manage to throw a suit on and a, and a flick or something, right? Every now and then, I do that. Yeah. yeah. No. yeah. I got to do that now because that's what they want. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, I can't just ignore that shit. Right. Because niggas expect that from, you know, I ain't going to do that shit all the time because I don't even. Yeah. Do Come on. But yeah, so, yo, matter of fact, one day, like, and this was, this was like when the shit, well, I was, I was in the, in, at, the at my peak and shit. Right. Mm -hmm. I'm right there in the city coming from the bank or whatever the fuck. I'm just walking out. I got my regular shit on. Right. Like, to me was like, yo, you look like Granddaddy IU, but I know you can't be Granddaddy IU because you don't got no suit on. And Granddaddy IU will never be caught without no motherfucking motherfucking suit on in the street. So, yo, I, I was like, yo, get the fuck out of here, man. Right, right. Yeah. So but I, I like the fact that once again, you know, and that's what we don't get. A lot of times we don't get, we older now, so we can pay homage, right? We can pay homage to to our elders and be like, you know, it is what it is. You dig what I'm saying? So I applaud that, man. I definitely applaud that, man, for real. I de with that being said, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get into it lightly. We gonna we just walk with me. Walk with your boy. I'm about to take you on a journey, baby. All right. All right. 
no interruption, See. no interference. So turn it up loud. And oh, I'm about to cut that up. Give me the mic and watch the whole place jump. Woo! I kick the quick rap, try to get raps and hit the lip. I ain't with that drip rap. I go for broke with the rhymes that I wrote. Quote, quote, for quote, even hit the high note. Drink, bitch, the bitch, I drink the big. So sway to the way K plays the mix, the bitch. <laughs> Grab a seat, take me to the arch with no short, short, little short hardcore. I'm like, but not quite, quite right. That's right. A parasite, right? I'll invite the fright night. Wow. So let it be known. The rap zone I own. So leave my phone and my microphone alone. I get paid. My lovers are slaves. You're going Ooh. out like a roach. I go out like raid. I won't back up or freeze up, slack up or ease up. Daddy, you was coach you and it's seeds up. I get raw with the rhymes I develop. So all of you suck up, but shut up, shut up. Oh, I'll bend your chin and grin. You can't win. So spend 10 to get in. Then get in. Y'all know where we going with this here. Understand that. Yo, listen. Yo, yo, I, yo, you know what's so crazy about that, right? Because once again, you know, during that era, right? Uh, How was what, you know, now you, you signed to a label, right? Right. How important was artist development back then? Um, I couldn't tell you at Cold Chilling. <laughs> <laughs> at Cold Chilling, we ain't had no, no such thing. You know what I'm saying? No, no such thing at Cold Chilling, but I, I came to understand what it was later. You know what I'm right. saying? But um, nah. And when I came, it's like, not for nothing, you know what I'm saying, respectfully. You know what I'm saying? Cold Chilling is one of the, one of the premier motherfucking hip-hop labels of all time. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. Up there with um, Def Jam and whoever the fuck. Right, else. <laughs> right. But um, when I when I when I came, they was on the decline. You know what I'm saying? Music was di getting different. You know what I'm saying? And I guess whatever, whatever internal shit they had going on. You know what I'm saying? So I I I, I wasn't there when they was doing all right, that. Right, 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 right. Now, how did you feel about that? Because of course, this is your, this is your, 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 your new, like you, now, because you know, reality is that, yeah, this is my new project. You dig what I'm saying? I am worldwide at that moment. How was sales? Were you concerned about sales, or you just wanted to put out a project? Remember, y'all, this is 1990. The, my first album, right? Nah, I didn't know shit about nothing. I was just making music, right? We was like. Actually, like I didn't, I never looked at it like I'm gonna get rich doing this shit or nah. It wasn't. Even, we started doing that shit not for money. We do. We was doing that shit because we love hip hop. You know. What right. I, mean? I didn't get into that shit like this is gonna be a career or a fucking occupation or none of that shit. Like yo, this this right here is in, this shit is like dr this shit is what's driving me right now. You know what I'm saying? Right. Right. Woo! Understand where you're coming from, y'all. The love of it. You see yeah. throughout the eras, the transition, everything has changed. And not to say that now he ain't about that money or whatever, but the yeah, heart. Now, yeah, now it's about money. You know right. I mean? I know what it is. But at that time, we was doing it because we loved this shit. Right. I, I would have right. done that shit without nothing. You know what I'm saying? I still right. know what nothing. Wow. When, when, when fucking, when Cole Schilling went bankrupt and shut down and all that shit, I still was doing music. Yo, yo, with that being said, I'm going to get into that next joint. I'm going to just play two off of this, man, but Smooth Assassins was just so mean, so mellow. Oh, man, I had to get into it, man. Once again, my people that's Don't getting on me, we, it's a lot of people tuning in. Yo, man, we on, we on Smooth Assassins, 1990, 30 years ago. It made 30 years ago, a couple of weeks ago, maybe a week ago. It's respected. Yeah, a couple of days ago. A couple of days ago, 30 years. 30 years. That's Woo! Good. With that being said, we're going to get into that sugar free. Uh, Woo! Come on, man. <laughs> Woo! Oh,
I really like you a lot, but it's a damn issue for you to pursue, because yo, boo, I'm good with you, man. Yo, you see, he took it back. Y'all, listen. Yo, you know this is, we talking errors. She sang the whole R&B song, right? Before he got one verse in, huh? Love yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> yo. <laughs> yo, That's and you know at the time, if you can remember that video, where was that shot? In New Orleans. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, we was like walking down Bourbon Street, man. With the, and that was in the motherfucking horse and carriage with the, with the, with the bitches. Right. Yeah, that's a fact. We Yo. With the New Orleans and shot that shit. Yo, but let me ask you something. Do you remember the, when, that, when, 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 this, when this song was released, right? And they uh, came to you and said, we wanted to shoot this in New Orleans. Where was you at? Like, oh, shit, I'm, I done hit it. You know what I mean? We was we was on tour somewhere else, like um, I think Houston or some shit. And then right. like we gotta go. We, we gotta book one of them fucking duster planes, them little shits, and fly you to go to the motherfucking uh, New Orleans to shoot the sugar free video. Wow. All right, let's go, nigga. Until I got on that little so hold up, you didn't know? You didn't officially nah. know? Nah. We was somewhere else doing some whole other shit. Wow. Hold up. Yo, hold up. Yo, before we get into before we get into anything, right? Yeah. Yo, Babs, Babs. I got Babs on the line, right? Babs want to talk about her song with you on that new joint. Can we can we link it in for a hot second? You come out, let us talk for a second. Yeah. My sister Babs. Yes, can can yo, yo, she gonna she gonna come in. She gonna come in for a second. And then you're going to link back out. We're going to talk some shit for a second, all right? Can we do that? All right. Say less. Say less. Babs, where you at, Babs? Hold up. I'm about to get Babs in right now. Babs. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, we get ready to have some fun with this, y'all. Oh, shit. Babs, hold up. Where you at, Babs? Uh-oh. I got to find her. Babs, where you at? Come on, man. Come on, man. We get ready. Yo, walk yeah. with me, are you? Come on. We about to have fun with this, baby. You got surprises for me and all kind of shit. Come on, baby. I play this game, baby. That's what's up. That's what's up. I play this, baby. She said, she said, I'm here. I see it. You see her? Nah, I see she said, I'm here. Okay, hold up. Oh my God! Yo, you got it. You got to chime out. Come out. Um, bad. Um, yeah, you come out and this year I get. Her, I got her. Bad. What's going on, y'all? Easy and breezy. Easy and breezy. Yes, yeah, kind of dark on my end, but you know it is what it is. I wanted to pop out real quick. Right, right. Well, first and foremost, I want to congratulate you and all the success. Oh man, 
the queens, y'all doing y'all thing. So I want to applaud you. You dig it? Thank you. Kings versus queens just went down this Saturday. It was history was made. It was yes. a lit situation. Woo! Woo! Yes. Woo! Listen, I applaud you, longevity. It, it, it's, it's a beautiful thing. I just love it. I love it. I love it. And I'll continue to support. Right? That's but what's on up. That I note, appreciate gonna, that. Of course, of course. But on that note, we're going to... What does IU, Granddaddy IU, mean to you, sis? That's my brother. You know what I'm saying? Not only is that my brother, that's like my mentor. Like, I was young. And IU took me under the wing. And, you know, and that's just been my brother for, for years. That's like, that's the bro. For real, for Woo! real. With that being said, I'm going to play a joint because I know you got to move. I'm going to play this joint on the essence on his last album, right? Oh, mm -hmm. man, I'm just going to get into it, y'all. Say less. Damn, recognize, nigga. Oh, hold up. That ain't it. That ain't it. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! But I'm me, and that's how we gon' get it. Oh, Bitches talk about the struggle when they don't live it. If it's the lick on the table, they won't hit it. When you shine, niggas won't take your son. Put the moon to your head. Translation gun. My raps like crack. They ain't taking none. Cause the Big Mac ain't the same without the bun. My pony tell them how without the bun. I let it hang. The get the album, y'all. I need y'all to support this motherfucking album right here. The Essence. Yes. Bam. I salute you, Babs. We appreciate you. I thank you for chiming in. I do appreciate you for real. Did it? You with me, Babs? Woo! Uh oh. Uh oh. No doubt. No doubt. We salute you, y'all. Make sure y'all get this album. Bab got another joint on there too. I'm out of here, baby. You already know. Later. Later. Thanks, Bab. All right. My peoples, how y'all liking it so far? Shorty Shaw, I like that first joint you got too, Shorty. Don't even listen. You got some mead. That first joint you got, Raya. I want to thank you, Raya. You are the best. Where's where 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 are you at? We need are you where you at? Are you 
Raya, you are the best. Yes. Are you where you at, brother? We need you back. We need you back. Yes. Yes, beloved. That first joint. Okay. Okay, are you? Come on, B. Here go me. Come on. <laughs> Come on, B. Are you? Come on, man. I had it. I said, let me, let me, let's play some ball. Let's get in this ring. You dig it? Yo, I ain't know you was going to have Baz on there, man. That's what's up. Come on. Yo, what did I say earlier? I, I just need to rewind this, man. Listen, the essence is currently out, right? You got a slew of artists, man, on this joint. I haven't, I haven't, that hasn't been done in a while. Hmm. Help me understand the importance of relationships, man, because it's obvious that a lot of those were, all of those were based off of relationships, man. Yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? And I don't even fuck with, I don't even fuck with niggas like that. I fuck with select few. So those are the real niggas that, that's who you hear on my joint. You know what I'm saying? It's other niggas that I do fuck with. You know what I'm saying? Of course. That, you know, that I just chose not, I don't fuck with them <clears throat> that much. Say that. Say less. Yeah, I could call a nigga like, yo, man, um, you know what I'm saying? I want you to hop on this joint. A nigga might be like, all right, um, how much you giving me? But I, I got I got I got I got like two of those. I got like two of those. Right, right. Out of everybody. You know what I'm saying? Right. It is what it is, because nobody don't owe me nothing. True story. You know True story. You know what I'm saying? I'm gracious, you know what I'm saying? I'm humble. I appreciate everybody that participated in the joint. You know what I'm saying? Hey, some niggas participated and they cut the mustard. You know what I'm saying? No disrespect. It ain't, you know what I'm saying? It might have been, it might have been a hot verse, but not a hot verse for this particular joint. You know now, with that being said, you, how long did it take you to put this project together? Um, it took a long time, actually, and it should really have. And I ain't gonna say nothing of why I did, but um <laughs> You know, <laughs> niggas know, <laughs> <laughs> but it's out. It's out. That's yeah. the most important thing that is out. It really, um, it really don't take that much time. Like you know what I'm saying. Like once you get the beats together and figure out who who matches, you know what I'm saying. That's what. That's that. My whole issue was this. I hear the beat right. I made the beat by. I hear who can I get on this motherfucker. Who who would sound? Who would sound? Perfect on this track right here, right? And that was my question. As opposed to who can I pick up the phone and call and actually get on the motherfucker? Right, you know right. Saying? So that was, you know what I'm saying, some issues that I had to weigh out and work out. But end of the day, everybody that came through was perfect on the joint. You know what I'm saying? They all did their thing. That goes for the, the vets on down to the, the newcomers, the niggas that you never heard before. Hopefully you will hear these niggas again after this. You know what I'm saying? That's what that was the theme of the project to me. Right. Yeah. Now, now, now with that being said, with that being said, I gotta get into one of my best joints on this month. It's a it's a it's a bunch, but this fully charged. I knew you I knew you was gonna say that one. Yo, that one. yo, and let me tell you something. You and Sadat X, right? Y'all work well. Y'all mean. Y'all gel well together, right? I don't know if people ever told you that, yeah. but y'all got a bunch of joints together on a few of your albums, right? Yeah, facts. And but we got, this we motherfucking got fully fight. charged? Yeah. When you put that together, man, I see, let me let me just rewind this, man. Listen, first and foremost, I didn't even know you produced like that. I knew it. Nobody really did, because I don't say nothing, but I've been I've been doing that shit. I produce for IC. I produce for Help the Skelter, Roxanne Shante, fucking wow. I, like all kinds of yeah. That shit is KRS One. Wow. Yeah. My own oh. shit for years. Wow. Yeah. Listen, a wealth of knowledge right Bad, here, y'all. Nigga, Babs, money. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Shall I go on? So listen. But with this fully charged, right? Yeah. Come on, man. How did you 
Like, did they come on? Listen, look who on here, Lil Fane, Rod Digger, Bumpy Knuckles. Yeah. Did they get in the studio with this, or you had to send the music out to them? This would have been mean in the studio. Everybody, everybody came to the studio besides Bumpy Knuckles, because he, you know what I'm saying, he lives um in south, down south somewhere now. Um who else? Um everybody else basically came there to the studio and did it. Oh, Method Man. Wow. Method Man, Method Man sent his verse, you know, he busy, you know what I'm saying? But let me tell you, that nigga that nigga I sent him the beat. The day after that nigga call me back, check your email. Just like that. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. With that being said, watch how this motherfucking beat come on, y'all, please. From a vibe, so when you kneel and put your hands together, pray I stay alive. To connect the puzzle pieces to all my unreleases. The story you're gonna have to read to find out who this beast was. I choke you with your gun in your hand. You never squeeze it. I bet you catch this death quicker than you catch your breath. Believe it. Fuck your surprise face because it's fire. Tell them Bumpy ain't got bars, you're a fucking liar. You ride this from top so you can see why. The rap god, not rap king, just hit his die. This is what I'm about. That mother said, I'll choke you with your gun in your hand, motherfucker. That shit crazy, right? That nigga hard. Yo. Nigga. That's some hard. Ball, That's a hard ass. Bumpy. Ball. Yo, Bumpy still. Oh, my fucking God. Yeah. yeah. Yo. So hold up, hold up, hold up. I got to ask you this. I got to ask you this, you. Mm. When you, once again, remember, you the producer behind this. You had all of them in mind. When you put this, when you laid this track down, I had I had MOP in mind first, right? right? But Billy Dance was upstate and shit, so we had scheduled fucking com um, conflict. You know what I'm saying? So we couldn't get back up here and do the shit. So we going back and forth, and I said, you know what? I want to put a girl on here, and I had I had um, matter of fact before that before that I had a whole different I had a whole different uh idea for the whole song. I was gonna do something else. I was gonna do something, take it somewhere else because I figured that if fucking MOP came to my mind first, whoever hit the track, that's gonna be the first motherfucker that comes to their mind. So I was gonna shock niggas and have an all girl shit. Woo! Right? And so I got this I got this girl, her name Alligator Alfred. 
I've I, I, I seen her on fucking Instagram. I just right. Said, she switched. She nice. She crazy. And she and then she she did the verse real quick, sent it back, and something happened, and I forgot about the record. And then when I got back to it, I had a different idea. Then so I right, went, right. Ball, went back with my original idea, what which was get fucking uh fame. And um then that's what I said. Billy didn't wake up. So I said, fuck it, I'm gonna get Rod Digger. Then Rod Digger did her shit. I'm thinking, who now? Who now? It's hard that can come behind fame and Rod Digger and close right. the shit. Bow. Call nigga Freddie Fox. He's like, I got you. That was it. That was it. Ain't no more. He closed it out something proper. Did he? Woo! The gun in your hand. You never know, squeeze it. <laughs> what? Come yeah. on, man. Yo, with that being said, we're going to get into another joint of mine, man. And, 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 and your man, Craig G. Craig G killed him. Listen to what he say, man. Oh, yeah, yeah. Legendary, y'all. Yeah. What's up, man? How you Tone Brown. Time, man? What? What is Two million. How many hours? 20. Yeah, people are. How's that working out for you? There's a whole other side to that, though, man. Look. So you got yourself a record deal. Congratulations, time to rock the nation. Songs in heavy rotation. Plot the plaques on your wall for every rotation. Check the situation, you got yourself placing. Started on the road, intimate venues, no cash from the door. A few drinks off the menu. 17 dates starting north to south. Radio stops to let them know your project is out. Three weeks straight grind, no time to chill, get home. Can't even go pay your phone bill. Something's fishy, ignore it. Just stay on your grizzly. They waiting for that single you release. Stay the zippy. You signed the 360. That merch is sold. A percentage of the top goes to them. Pay your souls. A cautionary tale about another lost soul. Take heed. Pay attention to this. It's slow to go. I know we do for time, right? I'm going to play just some small snippets from the joint, right? But right, right, let's right. Do it. Craig G spit some gems on there. Yeah. A lot of individuals, a lot of artists need to understand those 360s. Mm-hmm. You dig what I'm saying? Good look, good look and stuff. He said the whole album fire. That's right. Right. Yeah, so Stuck, tell niggas, nigga. Tell a friend. Yo, tell a friend. <laughs> yo, listen. Yo, Stuck, <laughs> listen. Yo, listen. It's been a long time since I was able to really listen to a 14-song album. You know, nowadays, dudes give you about eight joints. Talk about not as an EP. You know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> you yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. So you got to really be in tune. This album got nothing but slayers, man. So for some of those individuals that's on here that don't get a chance, if I didn't, if I didn't play it, no pun intended, I, you know what I mean? I just want to keep the flow going, man. But I want to tell you this. What's my man? What's the young bro name? Uh, Shorty, Shorty Tay? Shorty Sha. Shorty Sha. My fault. Sha, my fault. I'm getting ready to play that. He was smooth with it. The he opened it up intro. with the joint. The intro. Say less. Yes. A lot of people don't like to come in the prime. Because it is this motherfucking beat And I think if I wasn't even in the project, I probably would be afraid to come up in here too. This is a vicious environment. This is real. If you live up. A lot of people have got killed over here in the project. You know? This is an America far different from the one most of us know. Here we go. Big time hustler. Never take pictures. Hamburgers and hot dogs. Fed the youth center. Spent the block on the ice cream truck. My little sister got in trouble. Eating ice cream. I'm a tell My mother told my brothers better stay away from that nigga. He ain't nothing but bad news, ma. Look at my damn shoes. A cupcake for my birthday. One candle. Duct tape around the tray. Eight. Gun hand. Get my night. I bump in the door. The kids stand. You know what this is, give me anything for I blame you. Only God can judge the evils that man do. Nigga turn around before he got a chance to. Wow. When he seen blood on the sandals. 
you was holding the baby, maybe I understand you in the near future. Beware the fear of a scared shooter. The air is missed. Get the cash on a scooter, did a bed. It was 86. Blood on your phone, side when your life span. Could you measure with a rope? Shorty Shah. Oh, man. I never heard of you, bro, but I'm getting ready to go follow a lot of your music. I'm going to get right in tune. My man hugged that beat. Yeah. He, hug, he hugged it. Yeah, that's what he do. He hugged that bro. mother flower there for real. Yeah, son. So I, I take it you've been working with him for a little minute. Nah, man. Just, you know what I'm saying? I Listen, I, I met him at my man studio one time back in the days. He tell you and shit. And I gave, I gave him a beat. Him and my, he was fucking with uh, Patty Duke. Patty right. Duke. Uh, that 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 fuck with uh Nicky Nick yeah. right, right yeah and I gave them niggas a beat and shit but I didn't I never followed up and see what they did with it you know what I'm saying like it was just that and then later on right. I seen them on stage with Prince Poe he was doing some shit he stood out everybody was performing that night you know it was a um I think it was um Mike Hands um like a, a birthday party or something. So right, right, hands, hands of people, studies. yeah. Everybody, right. on, um, duck down, everybody, all type of niggas, and Shorty Shot stood out to me out of everybody. I was like, right. who the fuck is this nigga? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and, they right. was, and then we, I said, get that nigga to the studio. And when he came to the studio, it was like, yo, what up, you? I was like, he was like, nigga, you, you gave me a motherfucking beat at motherfucking uh, Freedom Crib. <laughs> Oh shit! I right, come on, nigga. <laughs> get on the track. <laughs> get on the motherfucking track. Let's go. And then we yo, just, that was it. We just from there it was history. We we just get it in. Where every time I hear something, I said, "Shorty Shaw will kill this right here." Woo! Like, he shot. hugged that mother flower. Shorty Shaw, salute you, baby. Yeah. Great sound. I'm gonna get into another one. We gonna keep on keeping on, right? Walk with me, baby. Walk with me. I'm getting ready to get into the essence. Ah, nothing, man. My nigga, empty the guard. Yes. Yeah. The essence, y'all. Scratch his body. Mr. Man, man empty the guard. Scratch Woo! His Can't leave my man out. Hold up. Hold up. I'm about to... The damn recognize, nigga. The, nobody. No. And D... Oh, DVR. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my man D.B. Elias Christ. He, yo, Elias Christ is mean with it. Oh, hook. man. Yo, yo, listen, y'all got to get this album, man, but I'm going to start it off, man. I'm going to go into I'm going to get right into it. Woo! Body harder. <laughs> rap, rap in the room. Break it down. Break get, get down. Get down. Hold it down. Recognize, nigga. Nobody, no, nobody harder. Break, rap, rap in the room. Break it down. Break it down. Break it down. Break it down. Back on the hundred terrace ab, it was me and little sister Missy. She my better half, man. I wonder if they miss me and the things we never had. Was too young to understand it, so I ain't never asked. Respect and I demand it. Go hard on every task. Got in trouble and got scars from each and every lash. Pain real in my bars and living in the past. Rather living in five stars than sitting in the class or sitting behind bars. I'm sticking to my path to a place where concrete looks different from the grass. These rappers beyond sleep, but me and I. You out that bag, lady, like was Khalif and Badu. Now that's crazy. Let's take it back to rap 80s when crack babies was too slim to act shady. I'm too wavy, and it ain't over the fat lady. Sing, and the pitch perfect like fat Amy. Hold it down. Nobody, nobody, Cushion to break the ball, switching up languages just in case the fans trace the calls. I've been used to corners since my mama had me facing walls. If you can't triple or double, then you playing facing ball. What you breaking for? If you already out breaking balls, pigs breaking doors. Hate to hate the blue breaking ball. I think the end I was dealt with and started playing cards. My bitches say I'm a. Woo! I need y'all to support this album, y'all. My guy. 
actually managed to get over 10 artists, man. And these are all relationships. All relationships. Great relationships. Get in tune, y'all. A producer. <coughs> Woo. Yeah. Huh? Wow. Well, listen. Now, listen. I want to get into... I'm going to deviate a little second, man. I want to get into that self-made man. I just need them to hear those balls. You dig it? All right. I'm going to get to... I, I want to get to that... <coughs> See, they ain't hear IU. So I'm going to play IU. That dope. How about that one? That's not dope. That's, um... What's that? Hold up. That's, um... That's on the S's. The S... Yeah. Hold up. Yeah. You sure... Dope. That's Shorty Shy. Uh, uh, um, no, no, hold up. My fault. My fault. I'm getting to this. I'm talking about PIMP. I'm talking about my neck of the woods. Oh, yeah. I, that, yeah, that's, that's um, 2015. The but there was still bars on there, man. Talk yes. to him. On there. Say no more. I'm going into it. All right. Yeah. Check it. Where I'm from, the hallways are wait busy. Girls gain life busy. One straight from the AK, you make your ass fish free. Jake, just me put the burners in my fish purse. So I disperse before the situation gets worse. I see niggas get knocked on the hump club. Police put 32 bullets to some love. The love keep bringing out the slugs. We bringing out from the place with Jake and Alicia keep saying about New York, New York. We call this new ditty. Put a price on your life. This little was too big. And the young girl goes dancing on the pole. Half a dollar bill stone. Had a soul stone. It don't matter. So she's in the devil. Be her way through yell. Yeah, right. More like to pay her boy to bail. And the sale that we caught being young and dumb. Preventing us from getting jobs. Now we trapped in the slum. With rings and fried rices. Dinner a night. Niggas get to drinking. That yak is going to be a fight. And Granny in the church paints eyes of the Lord. Meanwhile, the price of living, she can haul in your board. You say yourself, seem too good. It's probably your pro. But positive to love to war. Don't you know the world. I'm not sure I ain't no love no love, no love. I'm the in my neck of the world. The same shit is going on. Remember that shit is placed. It's being on the old side of the school. Yeah, the way that goes down. In my neck of the world. The same shit is going on. Hot off the press. Tyene, the sky shot. In the park, a lot of jam rock. Believe it or not, getting shooters. Get smooth. Now, I ain't going to say it. Uh -huh. The streets got a cold, my nigga. And I'll... Get into it, self-made man. He said yeah. that was 2015. Come yeah. on, big. No, no. Yeah, 2015. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You did the production behind this? That one right there was my man Blunt from Canada. A white cat. Yeah. Mean. That shit mean. That track mean. I was like, yeah, give me that. Give me that. <laughs> and what made you just take it back? Because you just, you went into a zone there. That's what the track dictated to me. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's like when I write, I, the, the, the music dictate what I'm saying where, I, where my pen go. Right. You know what I'm saying? So that's what that's what that that's what I, I felt when I heard that shit. Like, yeah. I'm gonna get into one more. We're gonna close it out, right? Uh, I need to woo. Which one is this? I'm gonna get into this. Oh man, hold up, hold up, hold up. We get ready to play a game right now. I think I might get into that hustling on this self-made man. Um, I forgot. What the? Nigga, I forgot hustling. Yo, he got so much music out, y'all. You yo. gotta love it. Yo, yo. With that being said, have you ever been on the stage, man, and you forgot some? You got you forgot a, a lyric or two? Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Hell yeah. Especially y'all be. I think I used to be drunk like a motherfucker too. <laughs> Hell yeah, I forgot some shit a couple of times. Not not like crazy, but yeah. Hell yeah. But you kept it going. Yeah. Now one time I like, hey, oh shit, I fucked up. And just <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> yeah, we gonna get into that self-made man, the album self-made man with hustling. Hustling. Damn. <laughs> I'm 
Still hear my mama curse. Pop only came around every two weeks. So every other Saturday, I got my ass beat. Then I started rebelling and hanging in the streets. Looking up to all the older G's I would eat. I wrote it. Leave jeans and fresh Adidas on my feet. I never got them. Some stickers had holes in the bottom and I fought hard. To hide my report card. Fucking out of summer school. They caught me a young fool. But the school was for the birds. And I ain't halfway. So fuck the on the road. I was in the other things. I already know the I already know man. Only thing I want to learn about now is getting mad. Told me life was a bitch from day one. I never became one. This nigga, I was raised on hustling. And where I'm from, you might get caught with a straight one. You fuck that I was raised on hustling. You either buy, sell drugs or booze. You chose all of these above. Cause my thugs is loose. Taking mad flicks, flashing your dope. I'm 42, that was proof. And what? That you was raised on hustling. Fuck, wow. Hold up, hold up. I had to, I had to resurrect the mental, y'all. I had to take him back. As soon as he heard that beat, he's like, Rrr. "Yo, cause you said, cause you said, you said it was on PIMP, but that's did on, I? Yeah, that's on Self Made Man. Self Made Man is two thousand and seven. No, two thousand and is it? Two, no, two thousand and fourteen, two thousand and twelve, wow. two thousand twelve, some shit like yeah." With that being said, man, I, I want to ask you, man, because you wear a lot of hats, man. Uh, what do you like more? Do you like the production or you like the the uh, the ramen aspect of it? Um, at this point, right now, the production. I, mm. I, I, I ain't writing rhyme right now in like damn, maybe <laughs> two years. Word. I still, you know what I'm saying. I still think of, think of lines and shit in my head. You know what I'm saying? From town to town. And I might, you know what I'm saying? I might jot something down. This shit is too crazy and I don't want to forget it. You know what I'm saying? I right. Write that shit down and come back to it whenever I feel like I, I want to write something. But right now, my heart ain't in writing right now. So I'm just chilling. You know what I mean? I, how long? Doing my beef and shit. There you go. How long How long do will you allow this 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 album to marinate before you move on to a new project? Oh, I got I got plans to start making on some shit right now. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I I've been chilling for like since this shit came out. I've been chilling. I ain't been doing. Really? I I might made a beat here and there. Like I said, I ain't been writing. I just be on some. I guess it's because of the COVID shit too. I'm just right. You know, I'm not. In, are I'm you not, Are you happy with I'm the response right now? Huh? Are you happy with the response on this album? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So far, you know what I'm saying. With minimum, minimal promotion, you know what I'm saying. Like we, ain't, we ain't had no budget. We had a budget, but you know what I'm saying. It was like the time it was with the COVID shit and a lot of shit we couldn't do. Right. Know? Like promotion wise, you know what I'm saying. Like interviews, you know what I'm saying. Live shit, and this, that, and the third world. So at the same time, it was like fuck it. Why not? You know what I'm saying. Niggas need something to listen to anyway. You know what I'm saying? So, no doubt. Yo, yeah. big bro. Yeah. <clears throat> we got 20 seconds, man, but please let the world know how could they get in contact with you? Right here on motherfucking um, <clears throat> IG. Just motherfucking DM me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I salute you. We out. Yeah. Peace. One. So these